Hi, don't go anywhere. We're just getting started. What you expect to know, how your body metabolizes seafood. On all the four blood types, O, A, B, and AB. Type O. Seafood, the second most concentrated animal protein. It's a good source of protein. Type A. Seafood, you can eat them three or four times a week. Many varieties of fish are rich in omega-3 fatty acid, which helps to protect against cardiovascular disease and cancer. You have a tendency for these diseases. Type B. Seafood, you thrive on it, especially the fish that is found in deep ocean like cod and salmon. They contain nutritious oils. Type AB. Seafood is an excellent source of protein and there's a wide variety of them available for you to eat. Type O. Richly oiled, cold water fish like cod and mackerel is good for you. Type A. Don't eat whitefish, sole and flounder because they have lectins which can irritate your digestive tract. Type B. You should be eating white fish like sole, halibut and flounder. They are a high quality protein. Type AB. You should avoid white fish like sole and flounder because the lectins cause problems for you. Type O. Cod and mackerel is beneficial to you because it contains what you need the most anti-inflammatory omega-3 fatty acid. It will also help you to build active tissue mass as effectively as red and organ meats. Type A. Add snail to your diet. The edible snail, Helix aspersal pomatia, contains powerful lectins, which may help to protect against breast cancer. It's, it's a positive kind of agglutination where the lectin helps to get rid of six cells. Type B. You should avoid all shellfish like crab, shrimp, lobster, mussels, etc. because they contain lectins that disrupt your system. Type AB. The edible snail Helix aspersal pomatia has powerful lectins that helps to prevent certain cancers that you are prone to. Let's break down what is grouped into. The 12 types of food is grouped into highly beneficial, which you need to be eating. And how do they really benefit you? Neutral, neither does good, nor does it have an ill effect on your system. So you can eat them occasionally and avoid foods you should eliminate from your diet. And why you need to really be avoiding them. And also how much of it you need to be eating on a weekly basis. Let's get into it. The link to video on food charts for your blood type is in the description below. Type O. The highly beneficial group of seafood for blood type O chart. Let's pick the ones with key plus sign and find out what they do. Cod, halibut, red snapper, trout, rainbow, wild. They improve your carbohydrate metabolism and help with your weight loss goals. The ones with upward arrow, bass, bluegill, bass, sea lake, bass, striped, cod, halibut, perch, perch ocean, pike, red snapper, shad, sole, sturgeon, swordfish, tilefish, trout, rainbow, wild, and yellow tail. They increase your bacterial population diversity and discourage imbalance in your gut. Type A. From the highly beneficial group of seafood for blood type A chart, let's pick the ones with key, plus sign, red snapper, and sardine. They improve your carbohydrate metabolism and help with your weight loss goals. The ones with upward arrow, carp, cod, mackerel, atlantic, monkfish, perch, perch walleye, pollock, atlantic, red snapper, salmon, atlantic, wild, salmon, chinook, salmon, sockeye, sardine, trout rainbow wild, trout sea, whitefish, and witting. They increase your bacterial population diversity and discourage imbalance in your gut. Type B. From the highly beneficial group of seafood for blood type B chart, let's pick the ones with 
key plus sign cod mackerel atlantic sardine scallop shad they improve your carbohydrate metabolism and help with your weight loss goals the ones with upward arrow cod croaker flounder grouper haddock hake halibut harvest fish mackerel atlantic mahi mahi monkfish perch ocean pickerel walleye pike porgy salmon atlantic wild salmon chinook salmon sock eye sardine scallop shad sole and sturgeon they increase your bacterial population diversity and discourage imbalance in your gut type ab from the highly beneficial group of seafood for blood type ab chart let's pick the ones with key plus sun and find out what they do cod mackerel atlantic and shad they actually improve your carbohydrate metabolism and help with your weight loss goals the ones with upward arrow cod grouper mackerel atlantic mahi mahi monkfish pickerel walleye pike porgy red snapper salmon atlantic wild salmon chinook salmon sock eye sardine shad snail escargot sturgeon and tuna bluefin they increase your bacterial population diversity and discourage imbalance in your gut you can eat neutral foods occasionally for nutrition and variety's sake type o from the avoid group of seafood for blood type o let's find out the ones with downward arrow abalone sea ear mutton fish they decrease your bacterial population diversity and encourage imbalance in your gut type a from the avoid group of seafood for blood type a the ones with key downward arrow bass striped bluefish eel oyster and tilefish they decrease your bacterial population diversity and encourage imbalance in your gut type b from the avoid group of seafood for blood type b the ones with key downward arrow bass striped eel and oyster they decrease your bacterial population diversity and encourage imbalance in your gut type ab from the avoid group of seafood for blood type a b chart let's pick the ones with key downward arrow bass striped eel and oyster they decrease your bacterial population diversity and encourage imbalance in your gut the weekly portion recommendation of seafood for blood type o is based on ancestral type all seafood 4 to 6 oz if you are african descendant 1 to 4 times caucasian 3 to 5 times asian 4 to 6 times weekly portion recommendation of seafood for blood type a based on ancestry is all recommended seafood 4 to 6 oz if you are african descendant up to 3 times caucasian 1 to 4 times asian 1 to 4 times the weekly portion recommendation of seafood for blood type b based on your ancestry is all recommended seafood 4 to 6 oz if you are african descendant 4 to 6 times caucasian 3 to 5 times asian 3 to 5 times the weekly portion recommendation of seafood for blood type ab based on your ancestry is all recommended seafood portion 4 to 6 oz If you are African descendant 3 to 5 times, Caucasian 3 to 5 times, Asian 4 to 6 times. Subscribe. Thank you for giving me thumbs up. Hit the bell notification for new videos and see you in my next video. Until then, take care.